Sure. Yes, please. Optional battles will now appear on Tinnemouth Hill. Whenever you move to a location you previously cleared, there's a chance of being drawn into an optional battle. You can choose to retreat with an optional battle while forming your battle party at the object or during the battle itself. If you face a difficult foe or want to press on to the next objective, there is no shame in an organized retreat. The better part of valor is discretion. Refer to the Warren Report for more details. Where this is important to mention is... The number mentioning here is... That scripted battle at the Tidmouth Hill, the story battle, that's a scripted fight. It's going to be the same either way. Random encounters, like the one from earlier, will um, level to reflect the... Um, will scale to reflect the level of your party. So, for example, in that last fight, two of my main characters were in the fight were had um, the, uh, we're at level three. So that means the fight would scale to reflect that. All right. Before we move on, uh, let's level up some skills for this class. All right. So let's see here. Skill point or little skills from party members. So I have ninety skill points. I only have one skill slot available, so I need to get a new one. And now I have a spot available for the Mighty Impact skill, which I picked up earlier. We're talking about skills that use tactic points. This is one of the ones that, in the last fight, this is a skill. That's one that uses that. So same thing, now I can teach Vice, teach Vice the Mighty Impact skill, or I could teach him Field Alchemy that would let him use more items in combat. Uh, he's an AI-based character, so I'm just burning through my items, so instead I will have him use, give him Mighty Impact. Katya. He has an open slot. What skills does she have? She has fine magic and cudgels that she's learned. She hasn't learned much of anything else. Both right, board skills, I'd like to I'd like her to learn one of these, so I'll let her level up in some more skill points. Ethelred. Not enough for Another slot. All of them need 90 points to get a skill slot before they can do any much of else much of anything else with it. Um and as you notice with the skill with the weapon skills here, they've started to level up. Their skill ranks in those skills through combat. Use them in combat. All right, one other thing. Um, almost forgot. We have two more divine magic skills and one fire and one air magic skill. Uh, so the so. Isleton pick started out with black mat dark magic. He can pick up one of these once he gets the relevant skill. 
But to do that, we need to add a skill slot. Uh, before I do that, though, actually, I'm going to add. I'm going to train in air magic. So, I, so well, when I get next level up, I'll have the points to get a skill slot to equip it to. Save my game one more time. Take a quick break and be right back. Let's pause for a second. Okay, so we've added Ethelred to the party here, and we're starting our next story mission. Abuna Donato, great father, never have I seen an undead throng that Necromancer uses men's souls for sport. Sleep souls embrace the waiting everworld. It happens. That's not good. Possible exorcism has failed. There was a course that would be stilled before the soul can be put to rest. Well, I haven't picked up the exorcism skill. I've forgotten much in the 15 years since I last faced the undead, but listen to me making excuses. Patient Leonar, we need only wait for reinforcements. And speak of which, here we are. There are the British. Great father smile upon us this day. Perhaps they merely bare their teeth at you, old man. The sleep has already taken your friends. In no common sleep, they descend the sepulchral stairs towards death. When they wake, it shall be as unliving horrors. Necroprentips. I guess he's a apprentice necromancer. We need only hold till Master Nibeth's return. Give them not an inch and show them no quarter. Back to the Vanquish Moldova. Bonus objective. Save Donato. Can I hit anybody from here? No. I'm coming as fast as we can. Please don't die, Donato. Alright, I'm just gonna say do a mid-mission save here. I know I've got the wheel I can use as well. The wheel only goes 50 turns. So this is the only reason to do is if you're doing an emulator for this is to do drop a save state at the start of a fight once you've deployed sweep this way towards Donato to assist but he blocked the attack I don't have exorcism yet Does heal magic work here like it does in Final Fantasy? That's this is an important thing to know. Okay, so exorcism you need to have exorcism to permanently destroy undead, which Donato has and my character and Jeremy can't cast because he's only level two and need to be level four to cast it. 
Okay, but heal does hurt the undead. Okay. I expect the item itself doesn't. And I suspect... Paralytic Wave, it might work. Yeah, it's worth a shot. There we go. Come at me. Can get I can get you up in his business. All right. Alright, so I need to heal Father Donato next turn. Or at least... Let's get, yeah, let's heal Father Donato. He needs it more. The rest of the undead. All right, Father, if you can get over there and deal with that skeleton real, uh, real quick, I'd appreciate it. Wing rise, ye watery fist. With fury flow, crush bone and flesh. Ow. Uh. Nope, that's, a that's just a 20% hit chance, so that's no good. Ah, uh, well. Okay, so it bumps me back to the start of the turn. Okay, and... Oh, and that actually hit, that actually hit Father Donato. That's good to know. Yeah, that's my best hit chances. Right there from the back, 25% and still miss. Uh, well. percent not perfect but it's worth a shot
All right, down here below the back attack. But it's enough. Okay. <sighs> and you got a magic leap. Nice. There we go. I'm gonna have you heal yourself. I'm gonna heal you just because I really want you to start working on casting exorcisms right now. None of you are in range yet, so I will just hold position here. You're gonna heal good. You keep healing vice. here. Well, the priest. Oh, you... He doesn't have the XP magic points to use it, because he keeps burning through the stupid spells. So we just have to beat Moldova. Complete match. Even if the rest of these really, really stupid party members won't just... Even if the, the AI party member won't just use a stupid exorcist ability. See if this if this will work.
There we go. One of them. Okay, that works. Oh, I just ran right past the enemy unit. That was stupid of me. Actually, you know what? Um, much better. Advancing, so that's good. Thank you. All right, just a moment. I need to make sure the cat gets fed or gets rousted to be fed. One moment, please. That stuff. All right. Okay, so I can't get in range of any enemy units at the moment. Excuse me. I can't get to you, so I can, you, I can, I'm a little dinged up, I can flank you, and pretty much it. I don't know, if you let me mo attack, then move. Yes, you will.
Oh. Well, if you're going to put that right in front of me, I'll take that. I really need to heal you. So you're right there. Actually, it's... Alright. Let's just get the definite hit planned at the back. I'll just take the definite hit on you. Where is Master Nysmith? What's keeping him? guy I killed earlier. Ouch. Okay, that's not good. There. That's you taken care of, and you'll be hopefully stay dead in three turns. Can't get to Necromancer. Actually, you know what? Um, you know what? I got this skill I haven't used yet. I have more than enough points to use it. Oh, that's a sure kill. Actually, um, hang on a sec. No, I can't get the etheroid from here. Yep, so let's do that again. That is enough to finish you off, so let's do it. Master Nysbeth, even in death I would have served you. Alright. Sorry for the stake for the delays for all this. 
Grom Grimoire Sommel. All right, Cleric is up to level three. Yes. And Isles does enough skill points for another to open up a slot. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. I also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks. Also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that. <laughs>